hey guys welcome back welcome back to the channel in this video let's have a look on the oppo find n smartphone so this is the oppo's first foldable smartphone after a long time of years so oppo is actually already under the research and development for this oppo find n smartphone for the last four years well now in this video let's have a look on the oppo find n some of the hands-on images and videos and then let's compare with the oppo find n with the galaxy z fold 3 and let's have a look on the oppo find n specs review well first of all the oppo find n smartphone is the first foldable smartphone from the oppo side and it is also a one of the compact smartphone in the world in the foldable series so samsung is the first brand to be launched in the foldable devices so they are already launched the three generation of a foldable smartphone so the galaxy fold the galaxy z fold 2 and then the galaxy z fold 3 now the oppo is now officially launched the oppo find n smartphone so this oppo find n smartphone is a really a good competitor to the galaxy z fold 3 smartphone and also the oppo find and is is actually priced at around a thousand two hundred dollars only so it is one of the interesting thing in the foldable smartphone segment now on comparing with the galaxy z fold 3 the oppo find and smartphone is one of the compact smartphone because it comes with a only a 5.49 inch of your display and it's a more smaller foldable smartphone compared to the galaxy z fold 3 smartphone and then as per the twitter user ice universe on comparing with the galaxy z fold 3 with the oppo find n smartphone the crease in the display is a very less compared to the galaxy z fold 3 as you seen in this image the galaxy z fold 3 and the oppo find n is side by side so in the galaxy z fold 3 the crease in the display is a larger compared to the oppo find n smartphone and also as you seen in this display in this display the display is actually turned off so as you seen here the oppo find n has the very less crease compared to the galaxy z fold 3 so in the galaxy z fold 3 there is a more impression in the display hinge compared to the oppo find n smartphone so it is also having a less impression in the around the hinge side but not that much as like the galaxy z fold 3 smartphone well now on the major difference between the galaxy z fold 3 and the oppo find n smartphone is the s pen support so in the galaxy z fold 3 you will get the s pen and also it has the ipx water certification but in the oppo find n smartphone so there is no s pen related support and there is no ipx of water certifications like that well now moving on to the oppo find n specifications this oppo find n is actually launched in the three different color variants one is a cloud floating light and then starry night and on dimension after folding the oppo find n will have a approximately 15.9 mm of a overall thickness and moving on to its display on the front side it has a 5.49 inch full hd plus super amoled display and this display is having up to 60 hertz of screen refresh rate and also this display is based on your curved display panel on the right side it has slightly curved so it has a secondary display of a 5.49 inch full hd plus 1917 into 988 pixel resolution and it is also a punch hole style design display and the main screen is having a 7.1 inch 1792 into 1920 pixel resolution and this display is based on a ltp Vivo AMOLED panel display and it is also supported with the up to 120 hertz of screen refresh rate and the main display is also having a punch hole style design display on the front side it has a dual selfies so one is on the secondary screen and one is on the main screen and both the selfies having a 32 megapixel of a pixel resolution and moving on to the rear side so it has a triple rear cameras one is a 50 megapixel main camera it has a sony imx 766 camera sensor it is runs on f 1.8 aperture and in addition to that 16 megapixel wide angle lens it is having a 123 degree of a field of view and they are finally a 13 megapixel of a telephoto lens then moving on to its other configuration it runs on a qualcomm snapdragon triple eight browser and it combined with the two different storage variants one is a 8 gb of ram with the 250 gb internal storage and one more is the 12 gb ram with the 512 gb of internal storage so both the ram and rom is comes with the latest standards so it has a lp ddr5 standard ram and ufs 3.1 type storage variant and this oppo find n is actually runs on oppo color os 12 based on android 12 operating system and finally this oppo find n smartphone is 
devices have a dual battery combination of a 4500 mAh of battery with 33 watts of wired fast charging support and 15 watts of wireless fast charging support and it is also supported with a 10 watts of reverse wireless fast charging support also and uh, moving on to the other connectivity option it is a 5G based smartphone and it is a dual nano sim support and it's supported with up to 12 5G bands well now these are all the some of the specifications of the Oppo Find and smartphone this is the Oppo's first foldable smartphone and uh, one more thing you have to note that uh, so this Oppo Find and smartphone will only available in the China region and there is uh, no information regarding the global markets and then Indian markets so currently this Oppo Find and smartphone is only available for a uh, China market well now what are your thoughts on this Oppo Find and smartphone compared to the Galaxy Z Fold 3 smartphone so the Galaxy Z Fold 3 smartphone is having a huge display but this Oppo Find and smartphone is a compact and smaller foldable smartphone compared to the Galaxy Z Fold 3 smartphone well what are your guys thoughts on this Oppo Find and smartphone let me know in the comment section below and that's all about this video guys and hopefully if you guys like this video hit the like button below and if you guys like to watch my upcoming videos hit the subscribe button below and thanks for watching this video guys